Hello Souk.com seller! In this video, we will go over the simple steps to add your new products on the platform. That means you'll be creating a new catalog not yet existing in Souk.com. To start listing, log into Selling Center, go to Inventory tab, then Item Listing. You can use either the category search, which will enable you to search for the category and will narrow down the subcategory until the page displays the item matching the search. You can also simply use the search bar on the top and type in some keywords about the item you're trying to list. A list of items matching the keywords you type in will be displayed. First, you want to make sure that the item is not yet listed in Souk.com. Keep in mind that you can narrow down the search using the brand filter or the category filter on the left side. If you still cannot find the item that you're trying to list, just click on the blue tab which shows Specify Your Own. Clicking on Specify Your Own means you will be creating a new catalog so you should have a ready list of your product details such as its specification, title, descriptions, and images. Based on your item's category, you will see a list of drop-down menus and free text fields. Just select or type in the specification requested. If your brand is not yet included on the drop-down list, you can choose Specify Your Own. Do not compose any brand name. Make sure that the new brand is registered to avoid any legality issues. Otherwise, you can enter Other if the item has no brand. Product titles and descriptions need to be provided both in English and in Arabic language for Souk.com customer convenience. If you're not sure which format or information to use for titles and descriptions, look for one similar product on existing catalog and copy the same format. Keep in mind that description should only contain item details. Make sure that there are no special characters or symbols promotional offers, and contact details such as your mobile number or website link because the listing will be rejected. To upload the images of your item, either click on Add Item Image or open the image folder, then drag and drop the photo. Product images must be in JPG or JPEG format, have a white background, not blurry, should not have any watermark, and should be at least 500 by 500 to 1600 by 1600 in pixel. At least three images per item is recommended, but you can upload up to maximum of six images. On the next page, you need to add your offer details. The quantity is the amount of stock you can supply in Souk.com. You can enter maximum of 2,000 and recommended minimum is three. Make sure that these stocks are readily available upon receiving the order. Price is your listing price. Keep in mind that we will still deduct the Souk.com commission fee and processing fee from this. Notice that the deduction or the commission fee is displayed every time you enter the price. SKUR Stock Keeping Unit is your unique item coding or the barcodes that you're using to easily locate and identify your items in stock. If the item has variations like color, sizes, or style, they should have a different SKU number. SKU is optional but is highly recommended for sellers who has huge inventory because if you have your own coding on your listing, it'll be easier for you to identify any specific item. Offer note is used for any extra that comes along with the product like warranty and guarantee information, free items, and in which country this item came from. You can also mention any disclaimer or any unique selling point which makes your item unique from any other same offers posted on the website. Keep in mind that some sellers can share the same catalog if they're selling the same item, but sometimes can have a different offer. One seller might be offering one year warranty and other has two years. This is the importance of offer note field. Keep in mind that offer note is optional too. Handling time is the amount of time provided for you to hand over the item to the courier. You have three options, same day, two business days, and three business days. By default, the buyer will be responsible for the shipping fee. However, if you wish to shoulder the shipping fee, just select this box while listing. 
you can always go back to this page and check this box if you wanted to offer free shipping in the future. Once done, click on Next to review the whole product information, then finally, click on Submit My Listing button. Once the product is listed, it goes through the provisioning process by our Global Content Operation team to review how it fits our listing standards and policies. In the meantime, you can find these listings in Inventory Management page of your Selling Dashboard under Pending tab. If all information are provided accordingly, listings should be live on the site within 24 to 48 hours. Please check our other video on how to create new item page with variances. Thank you and good luck!